Oh man, I tell you what, probably one of the best days I've had in my whole fucking life. Uh, I don't know if you can see me over here. I'm going to uh, kind of tidy up camp a little bit. They kind of came through in a whirlwind and uh, I'm not used to having visitors like that. So um, we're. Uh, style and little Ed gave me a handful of 22 shells um, so we're gonna get the gun all loaded up again get ready for some mice killing later on and uh, I gotta tell you it was the most amazing thing having the video going for Michelle um, when they pulled up because I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye and I figured it was Tweaky guy and um, turned out it was Michelle and actually it was Ed and Kaylin and Kaylin made a comment that she was standing across the creek she's all I bought a quad I bought a quad and she had it here with her so I'm like cool so I told him I'd meet him around the other side I met him around the other side and um, she's all hey we brought everybody we brought everybody and I'm like what do you mean everybody well it was Michelle and Seth and Ed and Kalen and Ed, and uh, I'll tell you what, in my 30 some odd years of being my sister's brother, I've never in my entire life had her come up and give me a hug like she just did. Um, it was the most amazing hug. She did not want to let go. Um, she loves me. She misses me. She's proud of me. She kind of gets it, I think. And... Um, it was the most amazing feeling to have her want to see me. It was just amazing. So, uh, just making sure we're good to go. Um, so, yeah, it really, really, really was awesome having all those guys come up here and, you know, take time out of their day to come up here and check on me and make sure I'm doing all right and all that good stuff. It, it just really was it made my week, it made my month. Um, at this point in time, it maybe even made my whole trip. So, um, I just couldn't be happier to have seen them and had them be able to go off and ride and do what they wanted to do and still, you know, give me a chance to sit back at camp with my sister and shoot the shit. And it really was just amazing. So, I'm gonna, uh, Kind of get things situated here, get things cleaned up, get this fire stoked, um, get a good fire going. They brought some food up with them that was not on my list, just total special, you know, here, thought you might want this stuff. Um, so that'll be awesome to, uh, to be able to enjoy some different food. Our fire's going out, so we're going to stoke it and get kind of camp cleaned up. It got kind of shitty on me here, so um, we're just going to keep moving some stuff around and getting some stuff situated and getting organized and putting some stuff away. Um, I'm just really happy. I'm just really happy to have seen them and have them come up here to see me and had them all be worried about me and and uh, trying to get this box open so I can put these shells in it. So we're going to get the tent tidied up first, and then uh, we'll start worrying about something to eat. Thing. Those were supposed to be my dry shoes, but now they're my wet shoes. And uh, life is good today. Getting hotter. I was holding on to her. Bring on that old straw. 
find our camera bag. There it is. Right where we left. So, yeah. Uh, just a great fucking day. I feel amazing. Uh, I think the coolest part for me was, honestly, was my sister. Uh, kind of had a disconnect for the last 15, 20 years, kind of been us against them and, you know, your team and my team and whatnot, and uh, she's just really surprised me and made me feel good and made me feel to a certain extent like she got it and understood what I was going through and made a comment about that she had noticed that I was a little bit different, and, um, you know, it just was really nice to, to have my sister come up and be able to see what I'm doing, be able to talk about it with me a little bit. Uh, I'm just trying to get camp situated here, forgive me. Uh, we busted this tote, no big deal. Trying to get that clean and dry. Ain't no thing about a chicken wing. We've got this uh, gas that I want to get into this container. So we're going to pour you in here. If we can. <laughs> Probably ought to get our funnel. hungry. I never ate. <laughs> I didn't eat a bite.
Okay. Uh, I'm actually going to turn the camera off. It's 7.45 and the batteries are showing yellow. So we're going to shut this off and we'll check in a little bit and get something to eat. Bye-bye.